What's up in the dub? Hey, LA finna show y'all some love. Hey, in the morning. Hey, in the morning. I wanna tell you I'm on my way. Hey, in the morning. Now, we finna get class in session. I'm finna ring the bell. Okay, y'all ready? We finna do Earth Signs, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. And I'm gonna try to shoot through this to get y'all some feedback. Okay? Let's clear the room. Okay, excuse me. Okay, we're gonna... Let me say my prayer. Father, watch over us and God and give us strength. Thank you very much the kindness that they need to forgive us. Okay. Okay. Now, I'm going to say, Archangel Michael, watch over from head to toe with my chakras from head to toe. And close me on my chakras. And one probably protect it. Send it in reverse it. Anybody that's trying to send harm to me, reverse it back to them ten times fold. I'm not here for that. I'm here to show love and light. So if people are here for other things, you need to move. Because I'm not with that. Archangel Michael. Archangel Michael. Archangel Michael. Archangel Michael. Archangel Michael. He says, I'm here. <laughs> he said, now you done got that cool bell. You know Archangel Michael. You know how I am. Okay, we're going to talk about what's going on with my Taurus. The next 72, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. Okay, Taurus, what's going on with you in the next 72 hours, Taurus? What can Taurus expect to go down in the next 72 hours. What's going down with Taurus? And how y'all doing? Like, share, and subscribe. Let's get busy. Okay, what's going down in, currently with Taurus? Okay. What else is going on? Whoops. There was something saying the void, Taurus. There's something that got voided. That something is voided. Okay, Taurus. What else? Why is void here for Taurus? In the next 72. From we're doing the 5th to the 8th. Well, yeah, the 5th to the 8th or the 5th to the 7th. One of the two. But anyway, that's what I'm doing. 5th to the 7th, I think. Um, there was somebody that doing mirror magic to someone. Cause it's, but it's been it's reversed. There was a mirror magic... They got voided, Taurus. What was this mirror magic? What's going on with this mirror magic with Taurus in the next 72 hours that got reversed? Well, because there, there was no rules. They didn't have no backup. So that's why it was versed. There was no backup that you had no jurisdiction. So you got back sent back. So everything been sent back. And so... There could be someone have a close call because there's a deer. I see someone being on a journey. And uh, choose any. Um, so someone might see um, a deer might pop up or something because something got reversed. And um, it says, choose anyone being designated as your quarrel. You always know the location and the status of your quarry. When you kill it, you immediately gain a level. Allegedly, someone is, um, when someone passes away or whatever, allegedly, someone may be getting a, either get hit and a deer might come out the blue or something. So be careful, Taurus. And uh, because something got reversed because you, you somebody was playing with magic and it's been back reversed. Um, yeah, and they did it. They were stuck on their throne when they did it. They wasn't bound down. So the tower, you know, asked for help. There's a tower. There's going to be a tower in your foundation. You need to ask for help. There is someone that um, is reversed because there's someone, yeah, like I said, tried to send a serpent out, but it's been reversed. So the comet, it was something coming to this planet, it's been reversed too. 
to attack this planet or something out here. It's it's uh reverse. What's the deal with this comment? Give me more. Well, the serpent serpent somebody Scorpio got reversed. What's the deal with the scorp scorpion in reverse? Um, someone got put in dungeon, spiritual jail. Someone got caught, and they're in spiritual jail right now. Someone is, what is spiritual jail? They put you and lock you up. You get locked up over there too, when you go on that plane and you're trying to do something. So somebody got a scorpion got reversed and put in, put in jail. What's this jail? Because of this uh, gym, because yeah, got locked up. They got set up. Uh, what else? Somebody got put in spiritual jail, and now they're not a jokester. They're not. Look, the dungeon. They got escorted to the dungeon, and the, they're not a jokester now. They're not. It, it's, jokes ain't no. It's reversed. They ain't no jokes in that. When you got thrown in jail, got caught on the. Uh, astral plane trying to do some dirt because yeah they thought they was creeping through the door to get through but they creeped themselves into something that they didn't want to creep because it got reversed back so I don't know that's crazy it got reversed back now let's see okay what happened here Taurus what happened here, Taurus? What got reversed back? What's going on here with this magic in the next 72 hours? Give me more details on this magic. What happened here? What's with Taurus in the next 72 hours? What's the deal with this magic that got all reversed back? It's like, you know, fair is fair. That's what I hear or something. What's going on here? This person got caught in spiritual jail for doing what? This, okay. An air sign got caught. What did they get caught doing? They got caught in spiritual jail doing what? What was they trying to do? Why they went to spiritual jail? Because back in the summer, what did they try to do back in the summer? They had no boundaries. Their boundaries were they they had no boundaries it's been reversed there was no boundaries in place so it was sideways so they need to make balance so that's why it needed balance and that's why this was happening so there was an incantation done but this person it was reversed because this person was clear they uh cleansed their energy and someone remembered someone of the past What's this? And uh, someone of the past with God. God in the past. What about the God? What's going on God in the past? Why is God reversed here? Because of the guardian. The guardian. What about the guardian? What about this guardian? What's going on with the guardian? Okay. To protect this union. Okay. They was guardian of this... Uh, High Priestess Union and grounding himself. So there was a guardian of it because people were wanting to do some. What did they want to do? They wanted to reverse this healer. They didn't want this healer. They tried to reverse the healer and the Fenomen, the verse, and, and then uh, this person right here was a, a containment. And, um, uh, they were contained. Contained with this tarot reader. Someone in the past. What about this tarot reader in the past? What's destined for this tarot reader? What's going to... Okay. Well, we got to do one at a time. What's destined for this tarot reader is prosperity. It will be prosperity. Even though they did this because they was put in contraction. They didn't want you to have it. But prosperity is still going to come. Because there was security around this house. You can't just come somewhere and think you're going to do something. So they're in spiritual jail right now. Okay. So we're gonna, So you can get your cup. Okay. Now let's see. What initials is this that done this to you, Taurus? 
that's messing with magic. What's the initial? Who is messing with magic, Taurus, against you? Who is you or this other person? Who's the initials? Are they first letter in their name? That's been playing with magic. Who's playing with magic? Who's been playing with magic? Who's been playing with magic? And next 72 hours. Who was playing with this magic? Next 72 hours. They won't tell me y'all. Who was playing with this magic in the last 17 year hours? Okay, see? They don't want to tell me. Okay, who's playing with this magic? Who's playing with this magic against the Taurus or the Taurus? Who's playing with magic, Taurus? Or was this you? Taurus, was you playing with magic? What's your initials? Who was playing with magic? Who's this person that was playing with magic? Who's this person that's playing with magic, Spirit? Someone with an N in their name. What else? Initials in this name. Who else was playing with magic, Spirit? What's their initial name? What are they name? N what? Who else was playing with magic against this tarot reader? NB, somebody with their initials NB. And what else? What's another initial? NB was playing with magic against this tarot reader. And uh, give me some more initials. Anything else? More initials? GI. What else? Any more initials that was playing with this magic? Any more initials that was playing with this magic? Again, so. Okay, hold on. Any more initials? Okay, we'll put, they got a Z, D, R, C. We have an M and P. We're playing with, the initials are someone that's been playing with magic against you. Now what they look like. Let's see. Taurus. What did this person resemble? What did they look like that was playing the magic? Is this you? Who was playing the magic? What they look like? Give me some example. What they look like in the shadow side. Who was this playing magic against you? Taurus. Or was it you? Who was this person that was playing magic against Taurus in the next 72 hours? Who's this person playing magic against Taurus in the next 72 hours? Who's this person was playing with magic the next? Who played magic? Was playing with magic against Taurus? Oh, Taurus, what do you look? Who was playing magic? Playing with magic? Was it you or that person? Who was playing with this magic? Preservance. Somebody like this was playing with magic. Don't let the picture fool you because this could be their features. That's something what they look like. Give you some example. And who else was playing with magic against you? Uh, look like somebody went to a mortician. That's what I look like. What I hear more. Somebody that does that. Specializes in that. Uh, what else does this person look like that went to the extreme to do magic on Taurus or Taurus on them? Um, naturalness. Naturalness. This person right here, very natural. This is the person that was putting magic on you too. That, um, may look like. Give you two examples. You see these two people? That's just something to give you the strength and know who's been playing with magic on you. Okay? So... Don't take this personally. This is just to help not to hurt anyone. Just to give you some feedback. Now this person is a naturalist. And uh, we have the 10. What's their shadow side? We want to know what their shadow side is. Number 10. Taurus. Okay Taurus. Their shadow side is. Selfishness. This person is very. Oh, hold on. Just a second, I'm trying to see something. It's just burr, This person's shadow side is self 
obsession, a naturalist. Once you understand that you are neither your name or your action, feeling thoughts or beliefs, you realize that human's nature is something for greater and uh, wider and than you ever suspected. Somebody likes being in a, in, in a situation. That's one. And then this one, 38. Okay, and then this one, shadow side, is strength. I mean, struggle. This person... Shadow side is struggle. They says, over time, through perseverance, love, and trust, you will eventually attain victory and experience your own direction. Somebody will... Uh, so, this person loves to... They have the shadow side is struggle. They like to struggle. The shadow side loves the struggle part. They love the struggle. Boy, that's 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 really deep, ain't it, Taurus? Too much. I don't love struggling. Okay, not me. Okay, let's see. What energy is this person? Okay, Spirit, what is the energy of this person? What is their energy? What is this preserving person's in it? What is the person here? What is they sign here? We're gonna start with this one. Preserving. Who's what's the what is they sign that's preservant? Who is this that's preservant? But they like struggle. They shadow side is struggle. Okay, what else is going? What's going on with this preserving person here? What sign is this person? Okay, this is a, a Libra. There's a Libra doing this to put magic on you. This person is a win-win outcome forecast, but this is a Libra. There's a Libra that's gonna win out of the situation anyway. Then we have uh, the naturalist. Who is the sign? What's this person's sign? Archangel Michael, what's this naturalist sign? Who is this naturalist? An Aries. There's it's time to take action. There's an Aries that needs to take action in their life. Cause like I said, there's a lot of people that your commitments are being tested under the quarter moon. So you're being tested, your commitments. They try to make sure that's what you want. But whoever put this magic on this, associate with these people like this. Um, what's going on with your relationship with this person? Is this person you're in a relationship with this? Uh, what's going on with your relationship? What currently going on with your relationship? At this time, in this time, in Taurus. What's going on with your relationship that's got something to do with this, Taurus? What's your relationship? Okay, what's this relationship about in the next 72 hours? Who's your relationship is? Uh, we have past life relationship. You have known each, each other before. You've known this person before. So... But religious factors is a factor in your romance. Forgiveness is a fact. You have to learn to forgive your parents before you can get better life. And you understand that. You have to give forgive the past to move forward. That's the way it works. You can't have anger to the next phase of your life. Now, it says, be safe. I mean, it says healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you be heal your family issues, Taurus. Because sometimes your, your family issues outweigh the comments of something that you should have left alone. 
Okay, what's else the message for Taurus before? Message for Taurus. Messages. What else message for Taurus? Okay, Taurus. It says Tiger. Doing something risky. Taking chance. Taurus, you're doing risky things and you're taking chance. That says a van, a vase, secret admirer. Somebody's a secret admirer. You're taking risk and what else? In the next 72 hours. What else are you going to be doing? Taurus, in the next 72 hours. What else, Taurus? Just a minute, y'all. Sorry. Just a minute. Hello? Hey? What you doing? They're sitting here for fin to finish, and I'm over here doing something right now. I had to call you back. I'm, I'm in a reading right now. It's okay. It's okay. Well, go ahead and watch the game. I love you. Okay. Bye bye. I love you. Bye bye. Okay. Sorry about that, y'all. Sorry about that. Okay. You know. Sorry about that, y'all. Got the phone call. You know how it is when you get the important phone calls. You got to answer. Sometimes you don't answer. You miss out on some things, you know. So let's get busy. Okay, my hair and I got messed up again. But oh well, you can't see. <laughs> but anyway, let's see what else. Let's see what came through. Sorry about that, y'all. Uh, they said the sharks take, uh, take care uh, or there will be some losses of material well you need to take care or you will lose some losses Taurus what else it says um, dolphins financial gain usually coming from something you did in the past it's gonna be financial something coming for what you did in the past for something you did in the past what is it there's a dog protecting you right now a powerful friend is tech to protecting you um, or helping you with your career but there's somebody protecting you while you do it helping you with your career and um, the table hard work ahead but it's some hard work ahead but it'll be paying off in the end it says um, valley deep personal strength and peace that assures success in the next 72 hours. Rainbow, the most dif difficult part of a situation is over. There's something that's about over, Taurus. So hang in there. Don't give up. Anything else, Taurus? Okay, we have carriage a journey physically or mentally somebody will be getting on a carriage physically or mentally so what's the deal with this carriage okay teapot deep friendship with someone at the same sex with the same sex somebody's in a relationship with the same sex haystack karma you will reap what you have sown Taurus basket reconciliation reward for your merits to Taurus it says a ladder it says um, climbing towards success you'll be climbing towards success but someone was getting karma or will get karma about a situation something they done okay okay Taurus I want to ask a question okay in the past relationship, what was this past relationship? What what life have y'all known each other before, Taurus? What was y'all in, in this la life before that y'all became with this past life? Who what what life did y'all do together? 
in a past life. What life did y'all do together in a past life, Taurus? This past life soul life. What did y'all do in the past together? What did y'all do in the past with this past life soulmate? What life? Vows. Okay. This past life soulmate is somebody that you had vows with. So you've already had vows with this person. This person you've already been married to. You had vows and what else with this person? What else did they have vows with this past life soulmate? What else did they have with this past life? Okay, Atlantis. Y'all was from Atlantis together. Something y'all did in Atlantis in the past. What else? A baby. Something associated with a baby in the past. What else? Life that y'all did together. What else have y'all did together in the past life? Taurus. What are you destined to do now in this life with this, with your, with the person that you have? What are you destined to do in this life? What are you here to do, Taurus, in this life? You're here for Asia. Something back in Asia. Someone might be Asian, but they're here because back in Asia and um, the Native energy, Native American. You're here because of the Native American and what else? Why are you here, Taurus? Why are you here here? Because of Asian and Native American and lessons and blessings. So you can learn your lessons and your blessings. That's pretty straightforward. Lessons and blessings and like one last card. What else they learn? What else are they going to get from this? What else are they here to do? Ships. Y'all have been on ships before in the past. Y'all have... In a past life. And then you have male and female. You got Y'all are learning how to balance that out. You got to learn this, how to balance out your male and your female energy. That's what's wrong with you, Taurus. You're not, you're not balancing that out. Your male and female energy. You're supposed to be able. You got to balance that out. So, okay. That is your reading for my Tauruses. And that was an earth sign. So, we're going to... What's next? Virgo. Virgo is your turn. Okay. Taurus, thank you. And I'm going to Virgo. Okay. Hi, Virgo. What you doing? Let's talk to you. Let's see what you hear or what you've done in a past life or the person that you with. Or what's going on in your life right now that you've got to know that you just can't. You know, get away from, you know, Taurus. What do you, I mean, Virgo, Taurus, talk to me too. Virgo, what can you get away from? Okay, I think that was pretty interesting. Okay, we're going to do, and we're going to do Virgo. So how you doing, Virgo? What's life treating you, Virgo? Has it been wonderful for you? You know, or you just been going through it, the motions? You know, sometimes we go through the motions. And there's nothing wrong with it, but we go through the motions. And ain't nothing wrong with it. Mm. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Okay? Now we're going to do... Virgo, what's going down with you currently? What What's the next? What's going down to, with the Virgo in the next 72 hours from the 5th on to the 7th? What's going down with Virgo in the next 72 hours from the 5th of December? What's going to be happening currently? What is going down? What is the outcome in the future? What is currently going down at this time that... Uh, Virgo can't see coming in the next 72 hours. Virgo, what you can't see coming in the next 72 hours, Virgo? Okay, Virgo, what you don't see coming in the next 72 hours, Virgo? What you don't see coming? 
Okay, Virgo, you don't see, you don't see the um, acting out. There's people acting out for your attention, Virgo. They be acting out. What else is going on? What's the outcome? What else is going on? Why is they acting out here? First of all, Virgo, why is all this acting out in the next 72 hours? Well, because there were some blocks. A dinosaur, some monster was blocking them from you. So that's what that was, Virgo. And also, um, there's no new job, new none of that, because it's been reversed. So, none of that, Virgo. What else? In the next seven, what else, Virgo? Next seventy two, what else, Virgo? Okay, we have see Virgo, someone was mirroring you also. We have the birds talk to you to bring you messages. And they're telling you about the comment that's been to come through. What is they telling you, Virgo? What is they telling you about next seventy two hours? They're telling you about the storm. There's bad storms that's gonna be coming through and they're trying to warn you about it. You know, it could be some some shipwrecks, some losses and stuff could occur behind this. Um, so, what's the outcome? I mean, what's the future of the situation in uh, what in your life? Okay, but it's a butterfly effect. See, people don't know the butterfly effect. It says um, there's a lot of butterfly effects going on that people don't have any clue. Also, like I said, it's been reversed. Something was sent to you, and it got sent back in reverse. And that's the way it is. Virgo sent it back. And that was no sun, because there's no sun that's in a situation when they sent it back, Virgo. What else, Virgo? Okay, plus the serpent reverse. They sent it back to that serpent, that scorpion. They sent it back to you. So it was reversed. Yeah, so the rhinos in reverse. What's the outcome? But you are guarded with the the outcome is you know you got your guardian angel, which is a a dog that's gonna be protecting you. What is this dog? It's gonna be protecting you. This is uh someone that told you in the far far that tried to burn you that. That what about this thrown in the fire? People were battling over this person, but they got thrown in the fire. Or what else? And the tower was tower fell down and needed help. What did they need help to do? Needed help to make a wish, take away the flesh eating disease they had, and uh, was on their throne. But they reversed everything. Everything has been reversed. So even the bats were sent back. Can't do nothing. The volcano was reversed too. So let's see what else we need to know. What's going on in your relationship? What's this currently going on? What's currently that going on in your relationship? What's the uh, outcome and future? What's currently going on in your relationship? Virgo, what's currently going on in your relationship? What's current on? So you got a bad storm coming. What's going on in your relationship, Virgo, in the next 72 hours? What's currently going on? The outcome and future. What's currently going on in your relationship, Virgo? What's currently going on, Virgo? What's currently going on, Virgo? Oh, engagement. Your love life is ascending to an engagement, Virgo. Okay, what is the uh, outcome of the situation? Outcome to this situation. Will you accept? There's a new love that's coming. You got a choice to take a new love, but you got to call on for whatever you choose to make here. So what does the future hold for you, Virgo? The future says... You know, you you said you're not releasing your ex. That's the whole problem. Release your ex in the future. Will you ever release your ex? Will you ever release your ex, Virgo? Is you going to release your ex ever? Will you ever release your ex, Virgo? 
trust. You need to have trust in this situation. Stay optimistic because your love life, you know, is it's different what you expect. Yes, this is your soul made in the future. This is the person that you're destined to be with. Yes, this person at a higher level. But there's a new love that's not gonna you're not gonna accept it. They're gonna come across to you like I want you, but you're not gonna give up your old love to do it. So that's that. Yeah. Let's see what else. Okay. What else to your person? What's his initials or hers? What's the initials of this person that is your soulmate, Virgo? What's the initials of this person that's your soulmate, Virgo? What's the initials of this person that you will marry and is your soulmate? Or are you already married to? What's the initial of this person? Your soulmate. What's the initial of your this person, your soulmate? What's the initials of this person, your soulmate? What's the initials of this person that's your soulmate? Okay, there's a W. I in the name could be our X. What else is your soulmate? Another initial that might be your soulmate. What's the initial that might be your soulmate, Virgo? A T in the name. What else? Initials that could be your soulmate. Initials. One more. Another W came out. What else is initials of your soulmate, Virgo? Anything else, Virgo? Initials of your soulmate? A V. So someone with a V in their name is your soulmate, Virgo? Okay. Anything else? Any other initials? Oh, your soulmate. So it could be. I guess that's it. Okay. So we got a W I X V T W. So two W's could be in the name. Okay. Now let's see. Let's get the cards. Let's see what your soulmate look like. That that might be your soulmate. What they look like. Okay, let's see what energy it is, too, first. Okay, Spirit, what is the energy that is your soulmate? What is this energy? What is their sign that is your soulmate of that you're destined to be here? What is the energy of the one you're destined to be with as your soulmate? Who is this that your soulmate is? What energy is this that is your soulmate in the next 72 hours? What energy is your soulmate? Or who is this that you're dating that's your soulmate? What energy is this that's your soulmate in the next 72 hours? What energy is your soulmate? What energy is your soulmate? What energy is your soulmate in the next 72 hours? For what energy is your soulmate? We have a cancer. You and your loved ones are safe. There's a new moon of cancer. So someone, a cancer could be your one of them. And who else? Your soulmate. So cancer and a Virgo. We also have the time to breathe out. Anticipate moon. So you need to breathe out about it. What other energy that could possibly be your soulmate here? Give me a couple more and then I'm done. Okay. We have Pisces, the waxing crescent moon. Have faith in your dreams. A Pisces could be your soulmate. And who else could be your soulmate? One more. That could possibly be your soulmate, Virgo. Who else is your soulmate? We have a Cancer, full moon in Cancer. A personal issue reaches resolution. And at the bottom we have another Pisces. Okay. A Leo could possibly. A Gemini. Okay. 
Well, that's it. Now we're going to see what they look like. What could your soulmate possibly look like at this time? What is their features? Okay, Virgo, what do your soulmate possibly look like at this time? This is all over the place because they're going to tell me what they want to tell me. Okay, so don't get mad at me. What do you possibly your soulmate look like at this time? Who do they look like your soulmate? What did they give you? Some kind of example of what they look like. Who in their shadow side? Okay. Okay. Okay, who is this person? In it? That what do they look like? Okay, this person in sight. This is your soulmate could look like. Oh my God, that's kind of creepy. Okay, this is what your soulmate look like. Give me an example. Oh, I'm thinking. Right here, see? That's one, that's what it look like. Your soulmate. What else your soulmate look like? Okay, who else your soulmate look like? In, let's just, okay, patience. That's your soulmate could look like another one. Then we're gonna get a couple more. I don't know. Soulmate. Integrity. Okay. Soulmates. These are the soulmates look like. Give you an example. Okay. Okay. Well, okay, that's that's that. I want to see the inside. This one here, forty-three. What was their um, shadow side number forty-three? Let's see what their shadow side number forty-three. This this person's shadow side is deafness. This person's deafness is shadow side. This person is deafness. They have a lot of, they don't, uh, they don't hear, they be deaf to stuff. Like, for instance, every human is being, is being, is born to be a rebel on the same, of filing a space in this world that cannot be duplicated by another. So, deafness and insight, they give, they have the gift of insight. I am here to invite Invite out the revel in you. The poem, the uh, lover, the mad scientist, the revenant. There is something only you can do. Something you, your entire life has prepared you for. It's, it's it's a time to take a risk and shake the system up. They want you to start taking the system up because this person likes to take a lot of risk. It, and they shake the system up, okay? Okay. That's all I had to say to you. Now we're moving on to um, who's next? Capricorn, okay? Sorry it took so long. Now Capricorn is pulled for you. Okay. And that was for Yeah, let's go to Capricorn. Capricorn, how you doing Capricorn? What's up? Let me see here. Let's get this crackalacka so we can get to you. So we're going to see what's going down with you Capricorn, okay? Let me get this up. Oh, Capricorn, what you up to? Have you been good? Have you been naughty or nice so you get them toys under that tree, Capricorn? 
Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn. Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn. Okay, here we go. Capricorn. What's going down with my Capricorn? Capricorn, what's going down with you? Capricorn. What's going down with you? Okay, let's see. Capricorn, I want to see what is currently going down with my Capricorn in their relationship. So, in the next 72 hours. From the 5th to the 7th. Okay. What else is going to of December? What is currently going on in your love life? And what is the outcome in the future? Okay, what is currently going on with Capricorn in love? What is currently going to outcome in the future of the situation? Okay, what's going on in love for my Capricorn the next 72 hours? Between the 5th and the 7th of 2022. Okay, let's see. What is the current situation going on with you? What's your current situation? Capricorn in love. We have trust. This situation is calling for you to have some trust. That's what's going on here. Okay, now what's the outcome of this relationship? What's the outcome? What's the outcome? Okay. The outcome is deception. They want you to pay attention to the red flags, Capricorn. Because you're not paying attention. What's the future of this relationship for Capricorn? Okay. Engagement. Your life is extending to engagement. So, what's the future? Give me more on the Capricorn's future here. Why is engagement here? What's going on future more? Capricorn will... It Engagement, what's going to happen after that? It says uh, romantic feelings are worth expressing. What else going on? Capricorn. In your future relationship. Okay, hold on. Okay. What is currently, why is deception here? Why is deception here in your relationship? Why is deception here going on with your relationship? Why is deception here, Capricorn, in your relationship? Why is deception here for you, Capricorn, in your relationship? Because you need to pay attention to the red flags that's, that's going on. You need to pay attention to the red flags. There's something going on that you can't see that um, you need to see. You need to pay attention to the red flags. What is the red flags? That uh, Capricorn is not paying attention to. What's one of the red flags that Capricorn is not paying attention to? Release your ex. You need to release your ex. But somebody is starting to do that. Somebody's trying to start to release their ex. And their old, their past wedding. They're trying to release their that. So they can move forward. They're trying to release the thinking that they think about it. And then it's worth waiting for. So. They want to let you know this relationship is a relationship of the it's worth wearing we're you know waiting for. So let's see. Let's give some beef. What else do we need to know? What is currently going on with Capricorn? And Capricorn, what else is currently going on with you? What's currently going on with Capricorn at this time that we need to talk about? Archangel Michael. What is currently going on? Okay. What is currently going on with Capricorn that, that we need to talk about? What's currently going on with Capricorn that we need to talk about? Messy situation. You need to run now. Somebody need to run. It's a messy situation. It's too many burdens left, period. There's too many burdens on this Capricorn in this situation. And that's the whole part that's going on with them. What is the situation 
the outcome to the situation, Capricorn? What is your Capricorn outcome in the next 72? What's the outcome to the situation? Outcome. Okay, we have struggles, worry. And it's going to be a lot of struggles, overburden. Somebody's uh, misguided. Somebody was misguided and messy as hell. Facts. Somebody was misguided and messy as hell. So who? that was the situation. What is the outcome? What does the future look like, the situation? What's the future look for you, Capricorn? I don't want to go too long. Hold on, y'all. I'm trying to get all these, but not go too long. Okay, Capricorn. Future, what a hold for you. What's going on in the future, Capricorn? What's going on in the future, Capricorn? The future says... Um, Deciding to stay or go. You have two things that you got to decide which one you want, Capricorn. You you need to decide if you're going to stay or you're going to go. That's the point. You don't know what you want to do. It says, you know, bad news, soon delays. There's some delays because you don't know what you want to do. Okay, and um, it says, returning from... Travels, self-doubt, failure. Someone has a lot of failures, and and someone this this heartbreaking lover, love and more job loss and more family ties and loss. There's a job loss and some heartbreak coming to you. To also about the situation. Anything else that I need to tell my lovely Capricorn at this time? It says at time. It, it said at times it may seem a struggle, an obstacles, a confrontation. Literally, your way ahead. You may complain about your gifts and your path. You are on, so don't feel like that. Don't feel like that. Don't be complaining about stuff. Then it's yeah, cause you know, ignore the those who preach down and gloom and have fun this weekend the simple facts is you never had it so good and have every right and every moment so enjoy yourself now it says stubborn weakness and dropping guard somebody gonna drop their guard and their stubbornness because they were too stubborn and needed to drop it and then we have lies fake not true something is not true in this lies what's these lies about what's these lies about developments why they're having environmental hurricanes really do come from butterflies plopping their rings high in the world so tell people how you really feel Capricorn stop not telling people that's a lot of the problem you're not telling it says you're reading in the situation too much there's something you stop reading all the situation too much because it was just too much. Okay. Your manifestations. Somebody wants to know why you cheated on me, but it was in reverse. And make a wish. You know, new lover, new everything because someone cheated. But anyway, okay. Let's see. So, who is this person cheating with? What does this person look like? That Capricorns, whoever Capricorn or the other person is cheating with. What do they look like? Allegedly? This is not to hurt nobody. This is give you insight. So 
going to go all off the deep end. What this person look like that is cheating at this time, Capricorn? What do they look like on you? Okay, what did this person look like that's cheating on you, Capricorn? Foresightedness. Someone is like this that's cheating on you. Naturalist. Discretion. Premonition. These three people may be cheating on you at this time, they say. Give you some kind of description of what they look like. Now, we want to know the initials of the people that... Okay, what's the initials of this foresighted person that cheated on you? What's the initials of this person with foresight that cheated on you? What's the what's the initials of this person or in their letter, their name, that cheated, that's on foresight, that cheated on you? What is this person... First name that cheated on you. Okay. An MP. They got MP in their name. An S. What else? They may have cheated. What else is that they may have in their name? K R U. Okay. Now. What about this person here, this naturalist that cheated on you? What could be their initials or just a letter in their name? It's all about, could be hairdresser and all kinds of stuff. What is the name that cheated on you? Give me some kind of initials or something. This person... Someone with an R in their name that they, they cheated on you. They cheated on you. Person with an R in your name. This is who they cheated with. This is with an R in their name. They cheated with this person. What else is their last name? This person that cheated on you. What is the last name? Of the person that with an R that cheated with or cheated on. Come on. What's it? Z S X and P that may have cheated on you R X R I they cheated on you okay now I guess that's it for you Capricorns okay I'm gonna close this and thank you for joining me I'll talk to you later Peace out. Keep watching. It gets better. Like, share, and subscribe.